All right, so today I'd like to talk about how to pan signals. Right now we have two oscillators going into a Moog filter, and then onto two separate VCAs, one for the left channel and one for the right channel. The first oscillator goes to the right channel, and the second to the left channel. We have a volume control for each channel as well. So, as it is, we can't pan the oscillators. They each go to their own channel. I'll close down the Moog container, and make the synth container bigger and move the IO mod and the VCAs over a bit. Let's delete the patch cords from the Moog filters outputs. In between this area, we'll add two modules. Go to Insert, Modifiers, and select Pan. Now, duplicate the Pan module. We're going to need one for every oscillator that we have. Connect the first output on the Moog filter to the input plug on the first pan module, and the second output to the second pan module. From here, we need to connect the left out on both pan modules to the signal plug on the first VCA, and the right out plugs to the signal plug on the second VCA. Now, if we pan the first oscillator hard left, it'll be sent to the first VCA, but if we pan it hard right, it'll go to the second VCA. Having it set up this way, we can actually mix the sounds that the two oscillators are producing. To do that, we're going to need some controls. So I'll add two knobs and two sliders. Connect the knobs to the pan plugs on the pan module. And the sliders to the volume plugs. So we have these volume controls over here, which take care of the left and right volume, and these two volume controls, which take care of the oscillator's volume. You can pan each oscillator to the left or right channel with these knobs. But first, we need to adjust some parameters. Right-click the knob and go to Automation. The pan module will send a signal hard left if it receives a voltage of negative 5, dead center with a voltage of 0, and hard right with a voltage of 5. Right now this knob is sending out a low voltage of 0 and a high voltage of 10. Set the low value to negative 5 and the high value to 5. Also, I'll rename the knob to oscillator 1 pan and oscillator 2 pan. and the sliders to oscillator 1 volume and oscillator 2 volume. Now we have some real control over the sound. You can mix and adjust the volume of each oscillator's waveform. So I hope that helps you understand how to pan signals. In the next video, we'll look at where to find some third-party modules and how to use them within Synthetit. Please rate and subscribe, and I'll see you next time.